In this problem, you're specifically told you have a trapezoidal prism. So what that means is you need to look for the prism is going to have two parallel and congruent bases, and they tell you it's a trapezoid. So when you look at these two uh, figures, you have this parallel lines here. You have these two parallel and congruent lateral faces. So again, here's the top one, and then the bottom one or however, whatever perspective you see that. But those are your two congruent and parallel trapezoids. So when you're look, looking to identify the height of this prism, the height is the perpendicular distance connecting those two parallel and congruent trapezoids. So the height can be measured on any of these four segments, and you see the one that actually has the length attached to it, and that gives you the height for your prism as being six inches.